Dali. Dali. Go inside now. Hey. <laughs> go, mama. Go. Hi, guys. Welcome back to my life on Filtered. So, this is an exciting vlog. I don't know how long I'm going to vlog, but today is Sunday and it's 11 p.m. at night, okay? And tomorrow is Monday and darling will be going to school for the first day. So important. Oh my God. I um I don't know how I feel about it. I definitely have mixed feelings. I'm excited for her to go so I can rest a little bit. <laughs> However, I also have a little bit of separation anxiety, okay? Like I've been with her for the past year and seven months. So yeah, it's going to be difficult for me to separate with her. And uh, of course, I have so many things going on in my head while she's at school. But hopefully everything goes well. There are other kids there, of course. And in Darlene's group, she's the smallest. She's the youngest, actually. And she is the only girl. That is scary. When her teacher told me that, I was like, hmm. I was not very comfortable with that situation, but trust my girl. She's a true daughter of her mother, so she's going to represent, okay? Yeah, so I just did her hair. The day has been so busy. Fortunately <coughs> enough, I did everything that I was supposed to do, so I thank God. I just did her hair finally. And Mama, come, darling. Come. Come and show them. I was supposed to actually braid her hair, but there was no time. I just had to do this. This this was the next best thing so <sighs> god i pray everything goes well and uh, this vlog might just be me taking her to school and coming back home tomorrow i plan to film the entire day fashion videos of course that is if i don't just come home and i decide to just rest because it's her first day and i deserve that rest okay give yourself that rest when you have the opportunity but we are quickly going to go to bed now. Quickly going to sleep. And see you guys in the morning when we wake up. So good night. Good morning. See student. 7.30. See. By the way, I just looked. I just took a second look at Darlene's hair at night. And I'm like, this type does not suit her face. She looks some type of ways. <laughs> oh my god. I'm supposed to I'll undo this hair before the week runs out. Hopefully, because this week is a very busy week. I, I doubt I have time. See students, see sleep at 7 30. Students, somebody is supposed to start school today. See, see, see the way it is sleep deep. <laughs> hey, hey, I feel sorry for her. So the day has started. Um, what do I need to do now? Wake her up. I'm not uh, bathing her in the morning because my friends advise that it's better to like with her when she comes back because they'll go to school, they'll play and uh, yeah, what's the need? So I'm just going to give her like small douche clean her down there, give her food because I want her to eat well in the morning. I don't know how she's going to welcome finished food because Darlene is already used to African food, spices, but no chili, but she's used to every other spices and she likes it. She eats everything. So I always want to make sure I feed her in the morning before she goes to school. So first things first is I'll wake her up now. Um, I wipe her, clean her, dress her up, brush her teeth, give her food, and then we take off for school, mama. Darlene, baby. Mama, wake up with your whole hairstyle. Darlene, Darlene, bye-bye. If I say bye-bye, she wake up. Darling, bye. I'm going. Eh? As, as usual, I'm running out of time. Oh my God. This is very unusual of me. Because I was... I was thinking only about Darlene's bread. I was not thinking about prepping myself. So, I woke up actually an hour ago. But, I was in bed just scrolling on my phone. Thinking that I have time. Now I'm pressuring the child to eat very fast. Oh. And Darlene, I'm not sure she's going to eat because she has never eaten this early. She has never had breakfast this early. So it's definitely going to be a new routine, a new struggle. 
I can't even, I couldn't show you guys any routine, anything because I don't have any. I'm still just trying to come up with something that is going to work for us because this is a huge change in her life. And I'm, I'm not very sure I'm, I'll make it to the bus stop on time, I swear. Yeah, but it's about, it's almost 8.30 and I told uh, the teacher there at the DK that I will be bringing her today at 9. So we still have 30 minutes. If I miss the bus, I might just walk, try and find my way to her school. But for now, let me just try and see if I can catch the bus at all. The bus is coming. We made it on time. The bus was late. So yeah, yeah. Mama, yo. Don't leave, mama. Here is Darlene's school. This is um, their section. It's very clean, eh? It's pretty new as well. Yeah, I like the environment a lot. So this is where I have to put her pram inside. Okay, here, bound. So I might just put her down and pack her pram inside here and then we go inside. Mama, are you ready? Are you ready? From now you're walking. I know you hate walking. She's going to start crying. Just wait and see. <coughs> Mama, Eva. You can come in. Okay, you have. Darling, go inside. Mene, Mama. Mm. Mm. You are here with Sari <laughs> and Sana and Tia. Yes. She's going to be fine. Oh yes, God. I think so. Mama, need my meta guy is important. Okay. Mutta tule kohta. Okay, man. Tule kohta, hakemaan. Darli, no täällä. Sari ottaa näitä sun tavaroita. Laitetaan sinut. Ha, oi, sinulla on kaunis haala. Laitetaan se tähän. Kiitos. Mitäs muuta? Ah, ota tämä pois. Otetaan täältä, mitä sinulla on. Täällä sinulla on. Uusia Täytyy varmaan tuoda Darlene tähän kuvat. Mm. Mm. Hyvä. Hyvä, mamma. Mm. Hyvä. No niin. Täällä Linna, Mai. Moi. Moi, moi. Sitten sä äitin, että moi,
Bye, mama. Bye, bye. Dalleria. See Dalleria. you soon. Yeah, see you Smiling. soon. Bye, Mama. Oh. Can I have a I think the most challenging and difficult part of my day is over because I was legit, legit, really, really scared of how it was going to look like. You know, leaving Darlene and how she was going to feel. But she apparently she felt really good, relaxed, you know, left without even saying goodbye, <laughs> not even wanting to look at me. So I'm sure I trust she's going to be very okay, apart from the fact that she's the only girl that I'm not very comfortable with. Mm, so yeah, I'm on my way to the house and I just decided to walk just to see the distance from this place to my house and i'm just taking this opportunity to to walk because i can't i'm not sure i'm going to work out today so basically this is spot for me i wish we really do not have winter because I, with this distance okay during summer it's totally fine but in winter oh my god this is so therapeutic walking like this you know it's very very nice but in winter back 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 not about this life no 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 you can't even try because to walk for 15 minutes under the kind of harsh cold that we have here in finland it's not even easy so yeah definitely 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 hopefully fingers crossed hopefully going to drive before then that's what i see every year but we move <laughs> it's time for me to go and pick up my baby and i'm so excited guys honestly Without Darlene at home, I feel like my life does not have any purpose. Honestly, that's the feeling. Like, oh my God, let me go and take my daughter. <laughs> I can't wait to see how she's going to react, but I know her normal reaction each time I leave her somewhere. And then I have to come pick her up. She cries immediately. She sees me. She just starts crying. No, she's not like that. Later this evening, I have... A surprise birthday party just dinner not party oh my god that i have to attend my friend's wife has a birthday has her birthday today so he's like organizing a surprise for her and now like this i have a dilemma because almost at the same time i have a package from the post office that i have to be at home to pick up so I don't know what to do because that package is very important, very, very important. So I don't just know how I'm going to handle it. But let me first of all get to Darling. We're going to sort that out later. So we are back home and um, the report from school is that Darling did really well. She didn't cry. She mm. slept well. She played. In fact, she played and messed up her outfit until they had to change her because the outfit that she went to school with is not what I picked her up with. So, yeah, means that they play be really worried. And then the only thing is she did not eat. And I'm not surprised, of course. She's already used to African food with spices, country pepper, bush pepper, bebe. And then I'm sure they just gave her one food that did not have any taste. So she didn't eat. But I'm feeling her right now. Why is your nose leaking? Hey, mama. Did they stay under the cold? Eh? Did they keep you under the cold for too long? So guys, I'm ready and I'm leaving now for the um, surprise dinner. 
and I'm dressed pretty simple like I'm not going to be there for long because I have to come back here like I said I have to come and pick my package if I don't I'm going to miss it so Darlene is downstairs already let me just take the stairs oh the lift is here let me take this lift this annoying lift so it was a surprise dinner and my friend did not know anything about it at this point she's inside waiting for her husband who is standing in front of the door now to come and take her out for dinner so she's prepared dressed and everything but her husband gave her a flimsy excuse to let the house and she's so pissed because he has been out for like an hour he came to pick me up and then to pick the cake and other stuff we came arranged everything downstairs and then we just popped in with food the balloons you know just everything and here you go she was so legit surprised like so surprised and, <laughs> and she, since she's a pakoro girl she did not even cry she just stood up and started dancing it was so fun we just it was so simple and nice we finished ate i did not even i was so hungry she was so, everybody was so hungry i didn't even have time to do to make any video for you guys so yeah this is all you're going to see about the, the dinner today is tuesday hello um guys i dropped darling off another day and it was quite easy today no stress no grumbling yesterday she grumbled <laughs> but i dropped her off and i'm going to shave my hair guys i'm going to shave my hair i don't know if i should go bald or i'm still thinking but i'm i really want to go bald eh? oh my god the lighting is really bad so when i get there i'll make a decision because guys I don't think I'll ever keep long hair again to like that. Even when I get old, it's going to be like this. So I'm going to shave. I definitely am going to color it. But I'll show you guys the results. Ta da! Hi guys! New look. It's been a while since I saw my face like this. Wow. I don't know if I look younger or older. <laughs> Anyways, I'm in the mad face now. I'm waiting for the girls. I have to go and put that up. I, I stayed in that salon for like three hours, like three solid hours. The place is just always full, always full. So happy. And then we go home. 